What's up guys, Lon here from Android Authority and we're taking a quick look at a pretty interesting product from Lenovo called the Yoga Book. There's a Windows version, but the one that we're checking out is the Android version and it's basically an ultra portable convertible notebook. It's got a nice metal build that gives it a very solid feel and it's incredibly thin and lightweight, which makes it perfect for traveling and overall it looks extremely sleek. There's a chain mail like hinge, which we've seen Lenovo use before in other products. And this allows you to rotate the screen 360 degrees and put it in whatever position you want, including a tablet mode. For as thin as it is, it does come with a couple of different ports like micro USB for charging, mini HDMI, a headphone jack, and speakers on the left and right sides with support for Dolby Atmos. The screen measures in at 10.1 inches with a resolution of 1080p, and it looked fine and will probably work well for anything you need to do, but it wasn't anything too mind-blowing. The rest of the specs include the Intel Atom X5 processor, 4 gigabytes of RAM, 64 gigs of internal storage, of which you can expand upon with the micro SD card slot for extra storage. It also has support for 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi and Bluetooth 4.0, and there's a massive 8,500 milliamp hour battery inside that should get you at least a day's worth of use. The coolest part about the Yoga Book is definitely the keyboard. Lenovo calls it the Halo keyboard and it's backlit with this very Tron S looking blue. And you'll notice that it's a completely flat keyboard. There's no real physical buttons, so it's basically like typing on a touchscreen. I will admit the typing experience does take some getting used to as it's very different from a normal keyboard with physical keys, but it's kind of addicting and sort of makes you feel like you're using something from the future. The other really awesome part about this keyboard is that you can place any ordinary notebook on it, write on it, and it'll digitally convert anything you've drawn or written right into the yoga book. This is great if you still love writing stuff down, but you also want to tie it all into your digital notes. We don't know what the exact limits are on how thick the notebook can be, but we were able to use a notebook that was over a half an inch thick and it still registered everything we wrote, so it was pretty impressive to say the least. It's running on Android 6.0 Marshmallow and it does have some customizations and a few apps to take advantage of the writing technology, but it's not a forked version of Android or anything like that, so you still have access to Google Play and everything else that you typically expect from a stock build of Android. We don't know the exact details on pricing and availability just yet, but it should be available later on this month or early next month. For the most up-to-date info, we'll definitely keep you posted over on the site at androidauthority.com and feel free to let us know your thoughts on the yoga book in the comments below. As always, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up down below. We definitely appreciate it. And also subscribe to the channel, which is also down below if you haven't already so you don't miss out on our future videos. And follow us on social media like Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, Google+, all that stuff will be down below. And keep it tuned here to Android Authority because we are your source for all things Android.